Bright sunshine of daylight and surveillance cameras, apparently not enough of a deterrent for a brazen shooter. Police say he was riding a dirt bike through a West Philly neighborhood yesterday when he shot and killed a man. Just another reminder of the gun violence rocking Philadelphia. I'm Jason Martinez. Marcus Espinosa is live at police headquarters with the very latest and frustrations in that neighborhood are reaching a boiling point, Marcus. Hey, Jason, that's right. They're sick and tired of telling folks they're sick and tired of the shooting, especially in broad day daylight. Now, we obtained footage with very clear images of the shooter on a dirt bike as well, adding even more concern potentially to the dirt bike ATV story and then also the, epi the uh, epidemic of gun violence in Philadelphia. Another shooting in broad daylight, this time right at 6.30 p.m. on Thursday at the corner of 52nd and Girard, this time leaving a 37-year-old man dead. The shooter appears to be a male uh, who was riding a green and white motorcycle. Uh, and uh, after the shooting, uh, fled eastbound on Girard from 52nd Street. Surveillance footage obtained by a storefront owner who did not want to be identified shows the shooter on a green dirt bike firing multiple shots into the sedan, all of it possibly stemming from a road rage incident. It is possible that this was a road rage incident. There might have been some incident uh, between the motorcycle, and we understand preliminary investigation also shows that there may have been multiple motorcycles involved initially, one of which returned and open fire on this vehicle. Police describe how the dirt bike rider went out of his way to identify and shoot the person, as you can see in this surveillance footage. A motorcyclist pulled up to the vehicle after following it southbound on 52nd Street and turning onto Girard, made a U-turn on Girard Avenue, came back, and at point blank range, fired six shots at the driver of the vehicle. Just two minutes before the shooter can be seen stopped at the corner of the sidewalk, checking his phone, appearing to wait for the correct car. Exactly two minutes later, he's seen on camera firing several shots into the car. Neighbors sick and tired of this never ending gun violence. I'm sick of it. I'm 60 years old. I'm tired of it. This 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 every day now. Now, Jason, I also reached out to some sources at the Philadelphia Police Department. We may expect something soon from their public relations uh, department regarding an ID. So if we get that anytime soon, we'll, soon, we'll certainly update that as well for the 6 o'clock as well. Jason. All right, Marcus Espinosa, we'll see you soon. Thank you.